Hello guys, welcome to yet another episode of Power Tips with Tejas. Guys, today I'm going to show you how to change the placeholder text from enter the title here to whatever you like. For example, as you can see, I have a custom post type FAQ that is frequently asked questions installed and activated. Now, when I'm clicking add new question, the placeholder text still shows enter title here. <clears throat> Sorry. Actually, it should be like enter new question here or enter new question, something relevant to the custom post type. So let us see how we can achieve this. Now, in order to achieve this, we will use the hook enter title here. So let's go to appearance editor. and click on themes function your functions.php file we'll start by writing a function function web v just a prefix change title here and we will return a value dollar new text okay and as I have said before we will use the hook enter title here so add filter first parameter that goes is the hook enter title here and the second parameter is the function name itself so web we change title here okay so now we will our new value new title in this variable dollar placeholder new text equal to here is my new title yo okay and we will return the value now we will save this file ok now we will click on add new question and we will open it in new tab and see whether this code is working or not and whether the title has been changed to this so our new title should appear uh, sorry placeholder text should appear yeah here is my new title yo okay so we have successfully changed the default <coughs> placeholder enter the text enter the title here text to our custom text but that is a problem suppose if you go to the post and click on add new here also it is showing the same placeholder text as in FAQ so for FAQ custom post type we want this placeholder text to be something like enter your question here whereas for the regular posts we want to keep it 
a default uh, enter the title here placeholder text so now let us fix this so coming back to the uh, functions.php we will use a function wordpress function called get current screen and we will store that value in a variable called dollar screen Let us look at the codex and see what get current screen is. Okay, so what the what this get current screen does? The, this function returns an object that includes the screen's ID, base, post type, taxonomy, among the other data points okay so what we will do we will use this get current screen and conditionally apply this placeholder text changes like if only when we are on faq add new faq screen we want this placeholder text to be changed okay so let us do that now so now here we have stored the value of get current screen in dollar screen now we will apply condition if dollar screen post type FAQ okay here this can be any custom post type for example if you have custom post type for job or library or books etc etc okay so now we will check this condition if the value of screen post type is equal to faq okay then we will change this placeholder text okay So basically what happens, let us look at this from beginning. We are de defining a function, web we change title here and returning the value uh, dollar placeholder new text. This can be whatever. Okay. Then we are storing the value of get current screen in another variable dollar screen and then conditionally we are checking if screen post value uh, post type is equal to FAQ here it can be any custom post types okay even usual post you can use instead of CPT if you want to change uh, placeholder text for normal post so here for our case if screen post type equals to FAQ then we will store the value new value rather here is my new title yo in the variable dollar post uh, placeholder new text and we will return the value so what happens if this condition is not fulfilled i mean if screen post type is not equal to faq it will not change the value of placeholder new text variable and whatever default variable dot default value is will be returned so now what will happen when we are on faq page we will have our new title whereas if we are on any other post type it will return the default value of the placeholder text so let us save and check this out Okay, 
Now here I am refreshing this FAQ post page. Reload. Sorry, we are on add new post. So ideally this should return the default value, default placeholder text. Enter title here. Okay, because we are on post, we are not on FAQ. So now let us go to FAQ and check out whether we are getting new placeholder text or not. Yes, here is my new title Yo. This is the placeholder text for our custom post type FAQ and for other any other post types it will be a default placeholder text. Enter title here. So this, this makes more sense to have a relevant placeholder text to the custom post types or any other post types. So guys, that's all in this Power Tips with Tejas. See you in the next episode. Till then, goodbye, take care, God bless.